Hi, finally I got my dream laptop that costed me somewhere around $4,200. This is MacBook Pro, the latest MacBook Pro with Intel i9 processor. Um, I, I had a question whether to go for MacBook now or not. But the thing was that MacBook Silicon is still looks far away because just before uh, like a couple of days I read that they still have some bugs to fix with that and MacBook Pro 16 inch particularly which is this laptop is uh, going to be released by February, March or April 2021. So I, I really needed a laptop at this point since my old MacBook was almost dying and I seriously needed a laptop so I decided to not to wait for MacBook Pros with silicon one but I chose for Intel one. So let's start unboxing this MacBook Pro. So this is something I really like about Apple product is that the boxing is really done nicely and in very sophisticated way so whatever price you actually pay wow this is 16 inch MacBook Pro so this is pretty much it like it's a you see this box is not at all shows anywhere that this is an Apple product because uh, it is the reason why uh, for safety purpose or whatever but this is really attractive to look at the macbook pro the configuration of this is uh, written somewhere oh no it's not no oh, something written here it's a 2.3 gigahertz processor i9 32 gb memory and uh, 16 inch so i think pretty much the thing that I, I was really looking for since the long time so this this is the time I'm gonna just open this so opening is really really easy and I was really excited about this since my software development work my cloud application mostly I'm doing web development and cloud applications so in that I'm using visual uh, Studio, Atom, uh, MariaDB and stuff like that in my local machine so that doesn't take that much memory honestly speaking but if you have so many Chrome tabs open and uh, in my previous MacBook had just 8GB uh, of the memory so that was not pretty much what I was looking for but this is having 32GB so this is a nice upgrade for me and uh, hopefully I won't have much trouble I'm already smelling good wow wow so this is really really easy to take it off wow so yeah so this is the laptop 16 inch um this is the charger this one cable this is just a manual with maybe stickers yeah so this is the apple stickers i got i never used it anywhere else in the past as well but yeah some people would be fond of using them somewhere i think just let me know where you would be using the stickers if you might have got it um then i have this yeah charger so this is interesting this is no more plastic so maybe for the environment purpose it's it's, it's, it's really good it, it's a nice material and certainly it looks recyclable i'm not sure whether it is actually or not but yeah it is recyclable looks so and then, oops, I just want to pull this out. Yeah, so I actually paid it via my Indian debit card and that costed me like somewhere like uh, 2,42,000 
rupees but in Canadian dollars that's 4200 Canadian dollars so it's a bit expensive but Apple products are never too cheap uh, I also heard that Apple silicone is going to be a little bit affordable than the we have but we have no official news yet but hopefully that will be much affordable because then I can of course order another one um, yeah so this is pretty much ready and nothing much dark in it so now the time is to open the actual machine which is this wow this is the experience that you get once in like a couple of years because wow this is really a good experience to open this laptop in this fashion This is so cool. Um, this is a bit heavier, but not like too much heavy. Easy to carry if you are just carrying it like that. And uh, yeah, let's just open it. You don't, you don't need to switch on or uh, do something like that. You just need to take this off. And yeah, it looks a bit big because I was using 13 inch screen before this one, so of course it's a different experience for me. Yeah, I just put it like that so that you can you guys can see that even. I'm gonna configure it. Um English India. To use English as the main language, press the return key. Okay, now I'm in Canada, so I'm just going to use Canada. Oops, it's a bit different while selecting the keys and everything. Um, okay, I got my internet. That's wrong over there. First time I'm typing here. Wow, that's a nice experience. It is about to be done, like configuration usually takes time. Um, well, if I talk about this trackpad, then it's a bit bigger, but I feel still it's fair enough. I see the keypad is a bit different, I assume. Um, Transfer information to this Mac if you have important in one Mac or PC related Mac you can also transfer on the time machine backup or a startup disk. Well, to be honest, I just want to start everything pretty fresh. I just don't want to mess up with this laptop uh, from the old data. I don't want to transfer anything now. Yeah, of course I do have Apple ID. Um, let me set up a liter. Yeah, let me set that up a liter, maybe. My name. Hello, hi Siri. Hey Siri, just start my machine for now. Hey 
case it is all my downloads. Hey Siri, what's the weather? Hey Siri, what does the rest of my day look like? Okay, look like it's ready. I will start with the light, eventually I will go with dark. Mm -hmm. This looks like a good experience for me. Wow! I'm really impressed by this the first screen and the wallpaper and the overall setup of this laptop. And I can see the Canadian flag, which I really love about this because uh, I don't know how they are showing these things uh, based on the country. If they are doing it for every country, then I really appreciate that. So it, it gives you a good feeling. It's instantly saying me that some updates are available. And you know, the best, worst part of the updates are they just make your machine too slow. If you keep updating your machine and if you keep up following their updates, you are likely to um you know reduce the life of your machine i i just hate these things about mac and everything um let me first open the browser looks like my internet is already connected wow this looks like a big screen to me since i was using 13 each so far and right away i will open myself wow this looks a bit different Mm -hmm. Browsing on the new machine is certainly a different feeling here. Okay. Wow. Remind me tomorrow. So, pretty much. That is it for now and that is my first experience about this machine just comment and let me know how do you feel about uh, having a machine at the moment or you are still waiting for apple silicon to be launched i i guess that those who are really in need of or in condition like me you may still get your um, intel machine now but if you can wait i would definitely recommend people to wait for the new apple silicon to be launched in 2021 because 4200 is a hefty money right it's not a small amount that you would spend on every other day so you can certainly wait if you can but this was about to my work and i could not wait anymore so i got it so thank you so much for watching this video stay tuned